What's up everybody? It is 5.02, actually two minutes late. Online winners, I'll take a photo of myself, eh? I gotta take a photo of myself, hold on you guys. All right, stand by while we check your photo. This could take a few minutes, so let me go ahead and start, or keep riding. I didn't get to make it all the way downtown before five o'clock, so I'm just gonna start out here and continue making my way downtown. All right, thanks for verifying your photo, it says, and I'm online. There should be a heavy amount of traffic. The White Sox game just let out. There's a Taylor Swift concert in town. I think the Cubs may have played today. And it's game two of the NBA Finals. Hoping Jimmy Buckets can get a win tonight. I am almost in a red area. There's a bunch of pollen in the air. Getting in my eyes. $6, 1.8 miles. Let's get it. Using the right lane, turn right on West Taylor Street, then turn right on South Union Avenue. Head east on West Taylor Street toward South Union Avenue. In 200 feet, turn right onto South Union Avenue. Seven seventeen West Maxwell. How you doing, sir? I got a pickup for Uber Eats. Appreciate it. No problem. Head west on West Maxwell Street toward South Halsted Street. Turn right onto South Halsted Street. In 800 feet, turn right onto West Roosevelt Road. Turn right onto West Roosevelt Road. Continue on West Roosevelt Road for three quarters of a mile. Made it. All right, got another one right away. Turn right on 9th Street. Turn right at 9th Street, then turn left onto South Clark Street. Gotcha. Turn left onto West Polk Street, then turn right. Uh, let me see the details here. Rami Martin. Oh, I'm here for a bottle of something. Okay. I'm looking for a place called the Urban Pantry. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Club Pilates. Oh, here it is, Urban Pantry. Man, they give you terrible advice on how to get here, but whatever. I got an Uber pickup, sir, with La for La Kissabee. Let's see, where are we going now? Start delivery. Head to your drop off at 21. Turn left onto East Roosevelt Road, then turn right onto South Wabash Avenue. All these Taylor Swift heads. You have arrived. Twenty-one thirty-eight. Got a food delivery for. 
Twelve oh four. Here we go. Oh, I need an ID too. And just your signature. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right, I got another one, you guys. I am on my way to Chinatown. It is super windy over on this side of town. At a delivery for 950? Yes, let's go. I barely saw that. Why isn't it? Man, my phone is on all the way. I don't I don't understand. Okay, anyway. Got ramen. Let's see here. Oh man. Oh, excuse me. Thank you. It's this one right here. Zachary, thank you. Next pickup says it's walking distance. All right, I got two here. I got two? Uh-huh. A couple more minutes? Okay, no worries, I'll be right back. All right, they said a couple more minutes, you guys, so that'll give me time to square this away because this is a lot of food to get out of people's way. Okay, you guys, I kind of rigged my bag up a little bit because I've got a huge order. So what I did was I took these uh, these bungee cords and I uh, put my Uber Eats bag at the top and connected the bungee cords together. I wish I had another blue one instead of this uh, purple one. Maybe I can make it tighter by going around the space here. Yeah, I did it. Okay, it's a little tighter now. So that should be good. And then I can just put the other one in here. It's been six minutes, so let me go ask if it's ready. Thank you, sir. Talk to you. Thank you. Oh my goodness, this is heavy. All right, y'all. I got an extra like, man, I'll say I got like an extra 20 pounds on my bike right now from all this food. But that's good right there. Try to tighten that up as best as possible. Let me try to make this one a little bit tighter. I'm gonna go around here. Right there. Then I'm gonna try to stretch it up. Can it make it? Please make it. Oh, yes. Okay, it's nice and tight now. Let's go. Got a lot of food with me. All right, let's see where I'm going first. Turn right for South Wentworth Avenue, then turn left. Let me get off my bike and walk it. Whoa. All right. That's why it's good to have bungee cords on you at all times, because without them, I wouldn't have been able to set this up like this. It is, this is heavy though. Like, this is pretty heavy. There's a lot of food in here. In a quarter mile, turn left onto South State Street. It is a bit awkward having this much food. I can feel that I'm not 100% balanced correctly. Like, I feel like the bike is leaning a little towards the left. All right, let's go. This is probably the biggest delivery I've ever had.
All right, first drop off is easy, you guys, because they just want me to drop it off with the doorman, which is great. All right, which one is Zachary's? I hope it's this one. Let me see. Yes, it is. All right. Turn left onto West Roosevelt Road. Whole lot of police activity. Oh, I'm gonna try to make it with the crosswalk here. In 800 feet, turn right onto South Clark Street. <laughs> Gotta take these off first before I forget to put them or take them off when I get out. I got a food delivery for you. All right, y'all, I'm just gonna take this last order. Oh my gosh, this is so heavy. I'm gonna put it in here. Goodness, look how big this is. Oh. Turn left onto West Polk Street. In 1,000 feet, turn right. Turn left onto West Harrison Street, then turn right onto South Franklin Street. Turn right onto South Franklin Street, then continue straight to stay on South Franklin Street. Five, I found it. You have arrived. All right, final drop off of this order. It's a challenging order to say the least. 25, please. Appreciate it. Right away. Right after the elevator. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. 1.9 miles. Cuisine, West Loop. Let's do it. Hello. Hello. Food pickup for Allison? Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Turn right after Potbelly, on the right, onto South Clinton Street. In 1,000 feet, turn left onto West Harrison Street. Man, Harrison is closed. I hate when they do this to me. I'm sorry, go ahead. In a quarter mile, turn right at South Wacker Drive. Drop off on the right. Drop off on Your the right. Your destination is on the right. Get out of here. Twenty five items. No thanks. 27 items, that's too many items. It's a nice payout. I looked at it and said, yeah, right. 
carrying 27 items on a bike that I don't think that's even doable. I mean, it is, but I don't want to take the chance of having to deliver like two milk gallons and water and all types of stuff that you need a car for. 604, 21 minutes, 2.1 miles total. You got 10 people watching this one. All right, so I got a uh, trip, or what's this? Yeah, trip radar. Head to your pickup at Rosati's Pizza, Grant Park. I got and it. A quarter mile turn right on East Monroe Street. What am I picking up here? 14 inch pizza. Appreciate it, thank you so much. Continue on South Michigan Avenue for one mile. Oh yeah, it's a pizza. Haha. <laughs> Wrong bag. New message from Kahina R. Okay, great. New message from Kahina R. Oh. Thank you. Do you know what the score is? Uh, it's, uh, 28 to 25. Oh, it's the first quarter? Yeah, first quarter. All right, thank you. Come on, Uber, let's keep it moving. Let's go, 660. Head to your pickup at Chipotle Mexican Grill, 10 E Jackson Boulevard. Head north on South Michigan Avenue toward East Van Buren Street. In 300 feet, turn left onto East Van Buren Street. Turn left onto East Van Buren Street. In 600 feet, turn right. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Head north on South State Street toward East Adams Street. In 600 feet, turn right onto East Monroe Street. In 800 feet, turn left onto South Michigan Avenue. See what these directions say. New message from DAB. 
Please bring up to apartment 1400. All right, it is uh, eight eleven, you guys. I'm quitting at nine o'clock, so I'm hoping Uber will keep me busy till then. I still got sixty-three percent battery left on my bike. You get a lot of questions about how much the battery lasts. It all depends, you guys. If all the drop-offs are relatively close, you can you can last a long time. But if the drop-offs and pickups are far from each other, then you know your battery's gonna die a lot sooner. And I've had both cases where you know the battery lasts a long time. I I'm on all day. And then the opposite is is true. I've, you know, in three hours I've I've killed the whole battery from 100 to zero because the the drop offs were so far from each other, or the pickups and the drop offs. Little scoop right here for bikers. Look at that. Let me try to get to another red area. This map is garbage. It's like, what does four times even mean? All right, and I'm in, uh, I'm in the red area, so let's see what happens this next 45 minutes. Temperature drop, that's for sure. All right, right in the middle of the red. Well, not quite right in the middle, but I'm gonna make myself tor go towards the middle. Come on, Uber, show some respect to us bikers here. 817, there is 100,000 restaurants this way, so come on, Uber. Yeah. Do you know your unzip in the back? Oh, I did not know. I got you. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you so much, man. Another hustle. That's it. That zipper. I'll, you know what? I'm just going to... Uh, okay. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, man. What a nice guy. What a nice guy, that guy. God bless him. Man. I know this happens to all of us from time to time, but I was unzipped in the back. I appreciate all the nice folks. You can pass by a hundred people and no one will tell you. I appreciate him so much right now. Come on, Uber, let me get one. Don't make me turn DoorDash on, Uber. See what DoorDash is talking about. Uh, no, it's saying that it's not busy in the exact area that I'm in right now. Look at that. So I got to schedule something. All right, Uber. I'm going to start making my way towards uh, Halstead. Good old Halstead Street. Straight shot down to my house. I mean, six miles away, but still somewhat of a straight shot. I'm on my way to another red area right here. I'll be in it for, I don't know, eight blocks, nine blocks, once I get there. All right, just started the red area. Beautiful night, a little hazy out here though. A lot of smog. Hold on, let me see. I can dash now. I'm gonna go ahead and start dashing. My acceptance rate is 58%. It says that I need to get it to 70% to have priority. Let me see. I got one. New order. Go to ramen son. I think I got a DoorDash. Fourteen. Accept. Let's go. Let me go ahead and go offline with Uber real quick. All right. Hold on. Let me pull over right here real quick. 219 North Green Street, Recenter. Hi. Appreciate it. All right, so she said that the pickup is in the back somewhere and that there's a window, which is cool. Just ride right up. Just ring the buzzer and our team will help out. Oh, there's a buzzer. Okay. Doorbell. Hi, I got a pickup for Tushar. Pre Thank, Thank you. <sighs> Confirm pickup. Confirm order was picked up. Confirm pickup. Oh, I got a pickup at Levain Bakery. Okay, I got another pickup. So it's a double order. I got a pickup for Jennifer M. Thank you, sir. You too. Confirm pickup. Confirm order was picked up. Okay. All right. Directions. Westlake. Nah, I'm not taking. This thing wants me to take 
Oh, heck no. <laughs> he thinks I'm on a motorcycle, so it's trying to get me to take the highway. That's one thing I was worried about, you guys. So th because I'm on the motorcycle, it's trying to get me to go, stupid back. It's trying to get me uh, to go on the freeway, which obviously I can't do. And I wouldn't even do it on the motorcycle. So I guess I have to change it to scooter because that's more in line with what my, my motorcycle actually is. But I think I'm going to be late to drop this off because obviously I would have gotten there a lot faster if I was on the freeway. So, uh, let's see how this goes. Oh, appreciate you so much. You drove this all the way from West Loop? Yes, sir. Oh, man. Yeah. So I appreciate it. Thank you. You too. All right. Let me get out of, out of here. How do I turn this off? Uh, what's it say? Finding orders, head back to the zone. Nah, I'm good. I just need to go home now. What's up, you guys? Oh, what's your boy? What's your boy? What's your boy? Are they winning? Yeah, they won. Jimmy Butler won? Yes! I don't even call it the Miami Heat. I call it Jimmy <laughs> Butler. I can't believe it. I can't believe they won. That's great. Oh my gosh. What a great day.